Meghan Markle has no idea what to do with Prince Harry after cutting royal ties. Now that Prince Harry has severed his relationship with the UK, Meghan Markle is unsure of what she wants to do with him. A prominent analyst claims that Prince Harry has nearly finished Americanizing after learning that he has made the US his permanent home. However, assistant editor of The Independent Sean O'Grady claims the Duchess of Sussex is left wondering what her husband should do next, drawing comparisons between the two to King Edward VIII and his American wife Wallace Simpson. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Composing for independent premium a substantial portion of the British public took the view that his American girlfriend had stolen our prince when he, King Edward VIII, abdicated in 1936, Mr. O'Grady stated. Maybe she did, but afterwards she didn't appear to know what to do with him. It's not totally clear what Meghan wants to do with Harry either, he continued. Mr. O'Grady claims that, aside from the Invictus Games and their own Archual Foundation, the couple left behind royal obligations and charitable functions when they departed the UK. He continued by claiming that nor can they mean much more of their experiences for Netflix, implying that the two are running out of material for reality-style documentaries. His research coincides with the release of Strawberry Jam, Meghan's debut product under the new company American Riviera Orchard. Fifty influencers were handed the luxury jam to sample, and several of them shared the product on social media. Images displayed the conserve in a fabric-covered glass jar with the Duchess's handwritten insignia imprinted on top. The lifestyle brand's future success is still unknown, though, as one royal expert has expressed unfavorable opinions on how the American public views the princess. Author of Traitor King, The Scandalous Exile of the Duke and Duchess of Windsor, Andrew Loney, exclusively spoke with Daily Express US and stated, I think she is a very destructive force, and I think on the American side, people can see through her. Rather than entering and making her way within, she believed she could alter the organization. Meghan believes that she is a part of a team and that everyone will submit to her, allowing her to do as she pleases. And she knows better than the institution, that has evolved over a thousand years. A PR expert claims that Meghan Markle made a calculated attempt in the branding of her new lifestyle brand to disassociate her notoriety from the enterprise. Last month, the Duchess of Sussex made the American Riviera Orchard announcement. It is anticipated to consist of multiple components, including a book, a blog, a Netflix culinary series, and numerous things available for purchase. Although Meghan has only recently started a new website and Instagram account for the brand, where users can join a waiting list, not much advertising has been done for it. As a marketing head, I see Meghan Markle's strategy with American Riviera Orchard as a calculated attempt to forge the company's identity apart from her notoriety, said Alex Taylor, a marketing specialist for Crown TV, to Daily Express US. By not having her name prominently included in the campaign, she may focus on building a brand that appeals to a wider audience on the basis of its own merits and services. Meghan's decision to go with the regal design may be a nod to her experiences and upbringing in addition to being a cunning marketing strategy. The royal theme appeals to customers who associate it with sophistication, elegance and luxury, these qualities can raise the brand's perceived value and attractiveness. According to PR specialist Luana Ribeira, who founded Dauntless PR, Meghan's decision to remove her name from her company's logo may be an attempt to draw in clients outside of her personal network. She did, however, tell Daily Express US that the Duchess' use of an elegant and luxurious design was a nod to her royal family roots.